Hi, everyone. Uh, in this case study, I will be presenting on uh, the practical strategies for improving uh, scale up in Southeast Asia. And this presentation is based on uh, an article uh, we published in the WHO Southeast Asian Journal of uh, Public Health. So as an introduction, uh, the program was uh, the Better Health uh, Program. Uh, that has been uh, addressing key health issues in the prevention and the control of uh, non-communicable diseases in Malaysia, Thailand, uh, Vietnam, and the Philippines. And this uh, study was conducted in the middle of uh, implementation of uh, the program. And the focus it was uh, on the sustainability and the scale up uh, of uh, the interventions. So the objective uh, of the assessment uh, was uh, to identify uh, practical strategies that can improve sustainability and the scale up of uh, four interventions in four countries in Southeast uh, Asia. So we applied uh, a staged approach uh, to explore the barriers, enablers, uh, and to identify the practical strategies that can improve the sustainability in the scale up of four uh, NCD interventions in four countries. The interventions were uh, a community-based uh, obesity prevention uh, intervention in Malaysia, a front of pack labeling uh, advocacy intervention in the Thailand, and local learning networks uh, in the Philippines, uh, and introducing uh, NCD surveillance system in uh, Vietnam. So we extracted evidence from uh, the peer reviewed uh, literature and the uh, local documents. Uh, and we also conducted uh, in-depth interviews with the implementation team and the key stakeholders in each country. And we conducted a thematic synthesis of uh, the resulting information to identify the practical strategies that can improve uh, sustainability and the scale up of uh, the uh, targeted interventions in the four countries. So this is the overall approach uh, of uh, the assessment. So we uh, started with uh, the global uh, evidence, uh, as that is evidence on strategies that can improve the sustainability and the scale up of interventions, those uh, targeted interventions. So any relevant evidence, we used a systematic approach for this one. And then we reviewed uh, the contextual evidence, what are the contextual factors that could influence uh, sustainability in the scale up. This uh, draw evidence from uh, the in depth interviews and from the review of local documents. And uh, the intervention related evidence uh, from the program documents. We also reviewed uh, the current uh, sustainability in the scale up strategies that exist in the program documents. Then uh, through a synthesis, we came up with uh, refined sustainability in the scale up uh, strategies. So these strategies include uh, new strategies or refined uh, refinement of uh, existing strategies and also suggestion on to improve uh, the implementation of uh, the existing strategies. So that is the overall uh, approach. Now uh, I will go to uh, some of uh, our findings. So this is uh, the article that's a source document for uh, this uh, case study. So you can see uh, it was published in 2023 uh, and it is on the practical strategies for improving the sustainability and scale up of NCD interventions uh, in four countries. And the paper focused on uh, the lessons from uh, the Better Health Program in the uh, four countries. And these are the main source, uh, sources of uh, evidence for uh, this assessment. So in each country we have uh, different sources, including sources for global evidence uh, and local evidence, and also uh, uh, discussions and interviews. Uh, the interviews included the country team, uh, NCD divisions uh, in each country, and uh, stakeholders like the Thai Low Salt uh, uh, Network, and also uh, academic partners in the implementation of uh, the program.
So as I have said, one of the focus areas of the review was existing sustainability and scale-up strategies. So for each intervention uh, in uh, the four countries, we reviewed uh, what were the existing sustainability and scale-up strategies, and also got reflections from the program uh, team and the key stakeholders on uh, the strengths and the weaknesses of this uh, uh, existing sustainability and scale-up strategies. And we summarized all that uh, evidence uh, as part of uh, the assessment. The other key task in this assessment was uh, exploration of enablers and uh, barriers for uh, implementation of those existing sustainability and scale-up strategies that were included in the program. And uh, through the interviews, uh, review of local documents, we identified some key uh, enablers uh, and barriers. And for the identification of refined strategies, we uh, used uh, enablers as a starting point, as a baseline to build upon these enablers and also the barriers. Uh, so we devised some strategies that can address or overcome uh, these, these barriers. And finally, we uh, go to uh, the practical uh, strategies that can improve uh, the sustainability and the scale up of the four interventions. So there was an initial list of uh, practical strategies which we developed based on uh, the assessment. Then uh, we shared those, uh, that draft strategy with the uh, country teams. They reviewed uh, the relevance, uh, the feasibility, and uh, the novelty of uh, each of those uh, practical strategies. And we rated them as a team. And there were some uh, strategies which are excluded from the final list, but this table shows the final list of uh, practical strategies for improving the sustainability and the scale up of uh, the interventions. So as you can see, uh, for each strategy, uh, we have uh, three, uh, rates. The N is uh, the novelty, uh, that is whether the uh, strategy was new, whether it was an enhanced version of existing strategy, or uh, it is a reiteration on the improvement of uh, its implementation. And the P was uh, the priority, that is the relevance of the strategy for the program team, and we rated them as high, medium, uh, and low, and F was uh, the feasibility of implementing this uh, based on uh, the resources as well as the remaining program period and the interests of the various stakeholders. So those uh, were rated again as high, uh, medium, uh, low, and uh, the program teams uh, uh, focused on uh, the priorities, high priority, and the highly feasible uh, strategies. So this was uh, the uh, final list of strategies that was provided for the program teams for implementation in the remaining period of uh, uh, the program uh, implementation. Uh, we didn't have evidence on uh, to what extent these strategies were uh, implemented and also uh, the outcome of the sustainability and the scale up of the programs in uh, each country. But uh, we believe uh, this approach provides an insight on how we uh, can assess the sustainability and the scale up strategies during implementation of uh, an NCD uh, program. Thank you very much.